started going. Yes, we uh, Ladies and gentlemen, Welcome. something weird is happening. What do you mean something weird is happening? I can hear... Hang on. Hang on, we're going to have to restart. Uh, no, we're, we're fine. That was weird. The audio of um, the opening cutscene was playing over the start screen. That was weird. Alright, last time we tried to do Jill's and we didn't do very well. We got the, the bad ending. And um, well, look, unpro- we, we got the bad ending because we were, do- were trying to do it quickly. And I just knocked my headphones off. And fighting still blamed me because apparently I was to blame. You played this game though, I haven't. <laughs> I played it ten years ago. Okay, let's do Chris's. Which I've never done, so you screwed this one. We are very much screwed. Luckily, this time we know what to do with the uh, with the um, shields. Yeah, so we're not going around like idiots going, hmm, how do we do this? 1998, July. Raccoon Forest. That was weird. Didn't like that. Hmm. It's... Someone has applied a grey filter. Oh, dear. Yeah. Northwest Raccoon City. Southeast Raccoon City is uh, where the Master Sword is. There's actually a Master Sword in Resident Evil. That'd be awesome. Yeah, it would. You go to Nemesis, go piss off. Yeah. I like how you've got you've got Raccoon in the forest, and then you've got the city. And, and then you've got the mansion wiped just wiped out somewhere. Shall we skip this cutscene? No, we've got to, we've got. I didn't have it the last one. You've got to have this on, even well, though we, we can't hear the bad. Last time because. The first, the, the first time I called you, I got into the mansion. Yeah, I mean, and we can't have the sound, unfortunately, on my end, but we've got to have the, at least the, the actual footage of it. Mm-hmm. It's, I, can't, I thought I could do like the the full screen thing, but it's not going to let me, so I'm going to have to make this an unlisted one as well. Who is that other guy? I have no idea. That's Joe Zahn, isn't it? What? The guy that uh, picked up the guy... The uh, arm that was holding a gun and screamed and got killed. Yeah. It's yeah, Jozan. Because you get Jill going, Jozan! Mm-hmm. Yes, walk around in the long grass. Yeah, it's, it's Jozan. Oh, God. I never worked that out. Is that a uh, Cerberus or is that a Hunter? Cerberus. Oh, yeah, Hunters last time were... Um... We didn't have much problem with the Hunters last time. No, because you followed my advice. Yeah, this... Yep. This storyline's going to be a little bit um, uh, more difficult. Ooh, lovely. Jason! <laughs> uh, That's his name. Yeah, I said that. Because you get Jason! Hmm. I love how Wesker's running away, yet he's the one who started it. Yeah, but they're still trying to kill him. <laughs> no! God, I love Don't it. Don't go! The voice acting isn't. This is fantastic. <laughs> if one thing was the evil is definitely famous for, it's voice acting. I love how weirdly they run. <laughs> I find it weird how Wesker... I mean, no co-comment on this. Wesker does look very, very greasy, doesn't he? He does. He does. Ooh, lovely. Hello, Fido. I don't remember that, Pete. That bit. No, I'm the Barry. Cast. Chris Redfield. Chris Redfield. He looks like a douche. <laughs> Jill Valentine. Uh, 23. Barry Bird. Yes, Barry. Who's age 90, according to this. <laughs> He's in pretty condition, Rebecca Chip. Oh you know, my god. By I'm... the end of this, apparently. She's gonna be dead. You've gotta protect her. See, look how greasy he looks. <laughs> He's meant to look greasy. He's the bad guy. <laughs> no. He didn't look greasy. I'd be disappointed. They have escaped into the mansion. Where they thought they. Uh, where they thought it was safe. But. Yet. What a mansion. Other scenario. 
I was going to say for a minute, then I'm like, eh, this is the same, but you, you know, instead of Barry, you've got uh, Chris. Barry? Where's Barry? Yes, leave the, the innocent girl with the clearly evil guy. Yes? Yeah, I've still got Cleve to death. Yeah, this is... Take care, Chris. Let's try and get the good ending this time, shall we? Let's try, but I don't know how you do it. Oh, <laughs> I think God. you tell Rebecca, whenever Rebecca asks to come with you, you, you let her come with you. Yeah, I just think. don't get killed. That's not the plan. Oh well, we're here. Might as well. That you see? Is, oh my! Oh god, we've got to. I'm gonna get used to that again. Let's take the icon while we're here. <laughs> Whilst we're here, we might as well take the emblem. So, so we don't uh, have to come back for I later. guess now I've just realised you're in Chris's scenario. It, it would have been Chris's blood, then, wouldn't it? it? Would have on Jill's scenario. Well, yeah. I mean, if you look careful, like, with Chris, with Chris being here, there's no blood there. So Ooh, hello, we've got a famous scene here. Which is creepier in the remake. So much creepier. Yeah, I know. This is the part where I got to where I managed to get the barriers to kill me, yet the next zombie killed me because of the controls. Oh, dear. And you're just telling Barry's not going to save you, is there? And you've got no gun. Why have you got no gun? You don't get You don't get given a gun in this first part. You only get the knife. Oh, great. We're going to have to take this hit. Come on. I'm gonna cut you down. Aha! Is he dead? Make sure he didn't. I'm gonna say he's gonna grab your leg again, isn't he? Oh, come off it. Not accepting that. So you get to look at his ugly eye again? Yes, we do. Back away. Oh, yeah, we didn't equip the knife. Why did we do that? I think that's a good idea. Yeah, that would be a good idea. Another good idea would be to get a better weapon. Hey, I can't do that. I'm an equal <laughs> opportunist. <laughs> He was a pacifist oh, last night, now he's an equal opportunist. I cut his arm off in one shot, good for me. Well, so we can't actually hug you yet? No, he can. I'll come off it. Haha. -ha. You're how just this trapping. Game works. I was going to say, if you went down to the other corridor, you're just trapping yourself there, really. Well, he's down now. Now kill him before he gets back up. Yes, I think he's dead now. Make sure it... What the hell How many hits does he take? Well, considering you're holding a knife... Take... I... Considering you're holding a knife, I'm not surprised. This guy can take the shots. Oh, it's dead now, finally. You hold That's a knife, such... though. It's Kenneth from the Stars Bravo team. Now, now he's to... become a mere shadow of its former self. Yeah, because he's dead. Because he's dead. <laughs> Of course he's a shadow of the You can't storm, pinch his gun, can he's you? He's fucking dead. If he wasn't dead, I'd be very surprised. If he wasn't dead, he'd okay. be a zombie coming back to ki coming, getting up and killing you anyway. Now, why the hell is that? Where's the gun? We're very, 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 very lacking in a gun. We're very lacking in anything, because I've never done Leon. I mean, not Leon, I mean... Uh, Leon's? Chris's. Chris's. Chris's scenario. Well, now we're on our own. Fantastic. Yes. Three guesses where Jill's gone. Oh, and we've got our screen share glitch already. What's happened here? This time we had uh, we had the uh, Chris's floating head while it was loading. Sometimes this is strange. Oh, is that the gun? Please tell me that's a gun, not an ink ribbon. You're gonna ki you're gonna cry if it's an ink ribbon, aren't you? I will literally cry. I will cry for <laughs> you. If that is an ink ribbon. It doesn't look like an ink ribbon. An ink ribbon would be smaller. Oh, it's Jill's gun. Yeah, we do get the pistol. Which actually looks really cool. I do like the look of the pistol. You've got no... Are we get... Uh, do you get the uh, Colt? You don't... I think you get the Magnum one on... Uh, or is it Magnum on Chris scenario? I think you do. Should we go say hello to the, uh, to the dogs? We might as well, though. Doggies, let's go, let's go say hello to the dogs. Which Silly some, dogs. Which you said you hated last night, yet you're suddenly really wanting to go straight to them. No, I said I hated them, but it doesn't mean I don't like them. Oh, oh look, what's in that statue? 
then again, it won't kill me. <laughs> that that if anyone has actually managed to see the um, our version of Jules, you will know that that it will kill you. Lots of things kill you <laughs> in this game. I forgot. I don't, you 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 did yourself, and then actually forgotten about that for temporarily then. What me saying? Oh, it won't kill me. No, I mean you. Me saying. I said me. I said basically said there uh, last night, folks. We heard a gas trap, and I said to fighting. Oh, you nearly said it off, and I like, no, it won't. Watch, and he did. He put it over the box, and it instantly said it off. So I had to reload and do it again, and my smart, my winning ways eventually won out, and we. We still got we the got bad end. We needed. We got the next uh, mo disc, did we not? We did, but we still got. <laughs> It's that's not that, even on par. Yeah, that's actually on the next recording, which is about under an hour, over an hour and forty odd minutes. Which yeah, means... we played that game for at least. We played it for a while. Please tell me that there is more than an ink ribbon in here this time. Okay, I'll... kill him. I don't think he's up dead yet. Should I just? I'll, like, I'll take it and I'll dump it in a minute. Three ink ribbons. That's not bad. Okay. Oh, screw that. I told I'm you he wouldn't be dead. <laughs> Screw this! I'm going back. I told There's you no you're dead. I mean, it's you'd... locked. Oh, it's a sword room. Okay, yeah, ladies and gentlemen. In the last one, we we figured out that there are a lot more armor doors and how than in this game than there were helmet doors. Yes. So I assume it's sword and shield doors in in Chris's scenario. Mm. So it's going to be a lot more of one than the other. We figured that out. There's probably going to be a lot more of us running around like headless chickens as well. Much more of that. Then again, that's a, that seems to be a signature of my Let's Play style. <laughs> getting killed. Actually, not, not getting killed. Getting eaten and then safe staying. Oh, just wondering what the hell we're supposed to do next and taking about an hour to do something that could have took two seconds. Uh-huh. That is it. I get off. I'm actually quite glad we didn't put the... We, I didn't start recording when we started because we would have had that shield thing going on for ages. That we would have. This game has auto aim, but it is dicking me over right now. <laughs> Last time you used it, why? I just don't understand why you're not using the, the uh, statue trick like you did with your scenario. Yeah, there. I did. Uh, I can only do that on one zombie, so I'm changing the zombie this time. Because last time we did on the. Uh, what? What? <laughs> not accepting that. Did not work this time, did it? No, he walked around it. They're smarter on this Chris's scenario, apparently, then. Yes, yeah, smarter than zombies. You remember the super zombie in Jill's? That was a letdown. Yeah, it's supposed to be hyper, and you didn't even give it a chance to bloody start moving. I put it in the cold, cold ground before it could get up. I'm sure that's a good thing. No, you look right. First, you thought I'd killed it, and then it went no, and then we had the cutscene where it came downstairs, and literally, as soon as you saw it coming out the door, you went nope, boom. <laughs> killed it with a shotgun. I don't. I can't remember if he killed him. Did he kill him with a shotgun? Or did I he... killed it with a shotgun. I did two shotgun shots. I remember that's what killed him. If you've ever watched some of this Let's Play, you'll see there's a lot of times where fighting. I'll just look at an enemy and they'll go, "Nope, I'm not letting you live." Of course, I'm not letting it live. It's a zombie. It's already dead. And then early on in the I'm doing it a service. Yeah. Then early on in Jill's scenario, he was complaining at me because I was saying kill the zombies. I okay. I will concede that, that killing the zombies is a good idea. When the hunters come around, if you have zombies, you're pretty screwed. <laughs> Which you still just about was without if you had done safe safe states. If I hadn't had so if I didn't have safe states, there'd be a lot of things wrong with this. Is a good job there's nobody underneath that. That would really hurt. Or getting spanged in the head. Yeah, <laughs> you just do this. Wee, oh. <laughs> oh god, we need to find Rebecca, don't we? Because we can't play this and not because Chris is shit at playing the piano, <laughs> seemingly. Yeah, it's just uh, like... Uh, there are zombies in here, but we don't have much ammo, so... Oh my god, not happening. Son of a... There yep. were three there, there were two in jails, and we had more ammo. So that was another nope moment, basically. Nope. I turned around and I fled. I fled like a... Like, like a pretty woman. <laughs> Let's be honest, because I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to get killed by zombies. I'm, I'm far too pretty. Should we go see Forrest? You mean see... Is Forrest still alive in this one, actually? Well, Forrest might be, considering... Considering the first one, we didn't get there for a while. 
when we went into when we found Forrest. Oh, hang on, there's something there. There wasn't anything here in Jill scenario. I bet you was an ink ribbon. A small key, which we didn't pick. We didn't pick up any small keys in Jill. I remember. No, we right. didn't. We just have spent ages trying to find the helmet key. Yeah, but the helmet key. No, we didn't. No, it was the um the shields thing we got problem with. Yeah, that was the, the main helmet. problem. Oh, hello, Forrest. <laughs> It's Forrest. He's been packed to death by crows. So search he's... him. Search him. Search him. Search him now. Take the mud. Take the bullets. Take the bullets, Chris. We need the clip. If we don't get the clip, we die. You mean if you don't, need... you don't get the clip, the crows come and attack you? We didn't get taken by the crows. It's all good. You, we didn't... That We tried uh, after doing that uh, Resident Evil. We tried doing Resident Evil 3, but that didn't really last long, did it? We got killed very quickly. In That's that because game. you two was hard mode. I thought it would be. I thought it would be doable. Apparently You've not. You've never played Resident Evil Three before. We, hard mode is stupid. The hard mode is hard. The game's hard in it's itself. Strange. The fact the game's alone for this hardness itself. You've never played it before, yet you still think, "Oh, we'll go in hard mode." Yep. I have the balls. Apparently I'm going to be using the knife more often to kill these zombies. While they're down, I mean, like, you know. Yeah. Seems like a good idea to conserve ammo. So when they go down, no need in shooting them, just switch out. Well, I can't even say about the ammo on this one because I really don't know. A carving of armor. More, more armor doors. <laughs> Seems to have every bloody door in this place. Oh, shot his armor. Well done, Chris. Nicely done. Stay away. Oh, no, no. By the uh, way, do you know that code, that uh, actual coded room we wanted to get into? Which one? Do you remember the one we we got we thought you needed to get into? Yeah, the one we never needed to get into, yeah? Yeah, you actually can get the code from Barry. Oh, yeah, that's point. probably why he died. Yes, because we didn't. <laughs> Just die already. So all the time we were like, where's the code? What's the code? We're stuck. We can't figure this out. We, we could have got the code from Barry, but we chose not to. Because we're, we're good people. Are we good people? No, because we still killed him. We didn't kill him. He killed himself. Are we actually going to do this reading this time properly? Or... Uh, no, everyone knows what the botany book is. So if we get any new books, we'll read that. Um, okay. So we know the botany book, which is all science, bitches. Nothing uncommon. I find it funny if it said, hmm, there's some, there's some uncommon stuff here. Oh, look, there's some weed oh, there. Awesome. <laughs> some, some heroin. <laughs> We've got to do the uh, Keeper's Diary, though. Seriously. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not killing these guys yet because I don't have enough ammo to kill them. That's fair enough. If it were your scenario, I'd say you need to kill them. Because in Jill's scenario, you have a ridiculous amount of ammo. We really did have a lot of ammo at the end of that, didn't we, though? Yeah, we had about... We had a lot of flame rounds. We had a load of... Um, pistol rounds. Yeah, a load of pistol rounds. A significant amount of magnum rounds. I'm being texted as we speak, and we are out of... Are we out of ammo? We, no, we have three bullets. Well, fantastic. We are very close to out of ammo. Yeah, at least we can pick up this green herb. <sighs> can we? Yeah, we can. We have enough room. Just. And you still haven't dumped Just the. Just enough room. You still haven't dumped the health spray, have you? Nope, we're jumping. No. Sorry, I'm just checking my text. No, uh, we go. Have to check my text. Yes, but this time, folks, I have made sure my battery is plugged in this time. Ah, the chemical. We need that for later. Yes, yeah, so we can make okay. Coca-Cola oh, fountain. Clips. Oh, I'm happy with life now. I have 30 bullets. <laughs> Still not a lot. Should I drop the knife? I'll keep the knife. I'll drop the emblem for now. I'm going to say I'll keep the knife just in case. Because if you run out of bullets, you're going to be like... Aah. I'm going to be like that anyway, considering we only have six fucking inventory spaces. And remember how badly we were with, with a... With, with uh, eight. Well, you, you, eight, kept, eight, you kept thinking... Eight, eight inventory spaces, we're trouble. Six, we're screwed. 
I'm, can Rebecca carry stuff? I can't remember. I doubt it. She's pretty much useless anyway. It's locked from the inside. Well, that's fantastic. <laughs> I have to go up here and face the two zombies, but luckily I have 33 bullets now instead of, well... Two or three, three yo. Yeah, three. All right. Back up the stairs. Apparently zombies have yet to, still yet to figure out the concept of the stairs. <laughs> Will, you just die already. I don't think he wants to. I'm going to get away. I run. I'm going to say run to the other side of him, otherwise he's going to grab your uh, leg out of there. Oh, he's dead. Is. Oh, is he? No, no, he ain't. What a double do. Use the combat now. And you're down to 22 shots. Oh, great. Are you missing that? Yeah, because he's far away. Just go away. At least they're both dead now. Oh, there's another one. There are more zombies in this le in this one. I swear to God. <laughs> of course there are. It's the hardest scenario. I know. Told me that. I ever thought everyone knew that. That's the whole reason I never played this one because no matter what you do. If you've pl played Resident Evil for the first time, you always do a dual scenario first. It's so much easier. These guys are taking more bullets as well. You down? Yeah, you're down for the count. At least we've cleared this place. <laughs> Hopefully we can get in here earlier. Yeah. I think we got in here later in this game. You do know that high pres if it's that rare, this is going that high presumption is going to be a lot worse. Oh great, the helmet door is still the fucking helmet door. You have a lighter this time, don't you? What? No, we don't start with a lighter. Whoa, whoa, I thought Leon had, I mean, why do I keep calling him Leon? Chris... Because you're right, in, in Resident Evil 2, Leon does start with the lighter. Yeah, but I thought Chris had the lighter and uh, Jill had the lockpick. Apparently not, yeah, I think we get it off Rebecca later. <laughs> So yay, we have to go find one of the most annoying characters in Resident Evil history. I wouldn't say that. I'd say she was the most annoying. In, I mean, proper Resident Evil. Oh, fair Picking enough. Angles, not much ammo. It's, you know, actual good game. Instead of, hi partner, hey partner, partner, partner. <clears throat> hey partner, I've broken my leg. <laughs> you can, can you help me out? No. Fuck her off. We can get the blue jewel while we're down here as well. So oh, got, yeah. What have we got? We've got a chemical, we've got two green herbs, we've got a pistol, we've got a bullet, and now we're about to pick up the blue gem. And we haven't got much, we haven't. We really haven't got a lot of ammo either. Nah. We are very low on ammo just because of the fact that this, this scenario is designed to be low on ammo. That's never fun. If a game just just, just hand, like handicaps you without ammo, let's go get a blue jewel. Yay, blue jewel! Why did we pick the red jewel up? Oh yeah, moose room. Yes, I said that last time. We had this discussion last time. A later moose room. There are two moose rooms in this game. We yeah. figured this out. That we figured that much out. Yes, sir. Uh... Because there's, there's one where there are two puzzles on each side of a room with a moose head in it, and then there's one with just moose head in it. <laughs> I wonder if you've, you haven't got, have you got the shotgun trap on this one as well? Can't remember. The shotgun trap? Do you know where the shotgun trap is basically where Jill, where Jill goes to get the shotgun in the ceiling nearly collapses on top of her? Yeah, I know. He was carrying bullets. Oh, for fuck's sake, I can't think of that. <laughs> oh, I have to use my herbs then. You're fine, combine the herbs, not use them. Oh yeah, I can do that, can I? Yes, you can. Combine. Yes, I will mix the herbs. We're not American, but we'll call them the herbs. Even the fact they're pronounced herbs. Yeah. F6. We have now got more bullets, which is much, much, much better. <laughs> it's locked from the inside. It's locked from the... It's locked. The carving of a sword. I'm definitely... I have a feeling we're going to need to find the sword key at some point. Yeah, I have a feeling I'm definitely going to have to edit this one. 
last one we managed to get away with not editing it. But right now we've played this game for more than half an hour and we have done so much less than we did the Jill one. Well, to be fair, the last one is only 40 minutes long. The next part, I'm doubting they'll let me upload it because it's an hour and 40 minutes. And it took half an hour to upload the last one. Well, then edit down the uh, the hour, uh, the, like cut it in th thirds. So it's. <laughs> I would do it, it's just I'm like. The like first time, like, should I see if it might actually upload it? Go ahead. I don't, I'm not going to complain. I'll blow a half finished Let's Play of Resident Evil. Just <laughs> scenario. This one is an actual recording. Yeah. Because we're actually doing it. Uh, this isn't exactly a speed run, this is just a run. Leviathan attempted run. a speed run of Resident Evil 2 earlier. What Leviathan? Yeah, well, it was it was doing it just as you called me and thought, mm, yeah, I'll do this one. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm not letting that happen. I wasted a bullet. I need bullets. <laughs> just die already. This is going to be funny when you get to a hunt part. Oh, what? That's not hitting. It moves right in my bullet line. It's, it's supposed to auto-aim as well. It is supposed to, but... Oh, now it is hitting his mate. <laughs> now get up. Get up! So I can kill you again. Get up, you son of a bitch, so I can shoot you again. Well, now he's dead. So it's his friend. Now we've got to kill their other friend. Well, I'm leaving him there. I don't have to kill him. I've just killed two of them, so now at least there's only one. Can we get in here early? No, we can't. It's a carving of a helmet. Jesus, every room in this mansion is locked. <laughs> or at least the zombies down here, or at least I hope they're still pretty manageable. I hope they're dead. No, no there aren't as many zombies down here. There are as many zombies down here. <laughs> Great. <laughs> is this where we find Rebecca? I think this is. This is where you get killed, near oh. enough. Did Rebecca just try to shoot it, poisoning you? I could shoot you in the face if I wanted. And you're really fucking irritating. <laughs> Uh, Code Veronica, where you could play as Chris. I haven't played Code Veronica yet. It's alright. I keep seeing like it, uh, it for like a quid in like my local CEX, but I'm like, mm. uh, I could spend that quid on other things. Well, the thing is, if a Resident Evil game is that low down, it's more than likely to not be that good. No, Code Veronica is. It's not like some flavor. Ah, okay. I'll pick it up if I see it again then. Fire. Oh, we're having problems with the audio here. Is your mic set up properly? Because we're having a little bit of problems with the audio. Yeah, you'd be going a bit gaggler. Is it connection or...? It's my fault. Oh. 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 I can hear like hear you in patches now. I can hear like eh, 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 eh. Oh. Oh. Now I can, yes. I can hear you slightly even there, it just it keeps going off. Yeah. 
Alright, if you just give me a minute, I'm just gonna like pause if. Luckily, we can go and grab um, some. one of the emblems, I think. Hey, I'll go zombie. Nightmare of Gone's Dreams. No, <laughs> not Nightmare of My Dreams. Nightmare of Your Dreams. I, I realise that makes no sense. The Nightmare of My Dreams with the Alco Bloody Hunter. Oh, yeah. At least we get rid of this early. Yeah, what do we get? What do we get this time around? Wind moon crest again. Oh. No, wind crest. You should show a show. You know we could use show with some bullets. Like some bullets, please, game. We could use some. We could use a better gun as well, game. Shh. Not a shotgun. It's not like there's not many weapons in this game if you think about it. Magnum shotgun. Colt. Pistol. Broken shotgun. You've got. Oh, wait, well, you took the other shotgun, didn't you? What, the uh, broken shotgun? No, you've got You've got to deal with the broken shotgun on this one, haven't you? Yes. Which, luckily, we, we found that in the um, Jill Let's Play, didn't we? Yeah, but we got the uh, other shotgun, which means the only only one that'll be left is the broken one. Or will it? I don't know. It works That's that way in Resident works. Evil 2. Yeah, in Resident Evil 2, that is how it works, but not in this one. Because in this one, um, it's not side by side. Ah. It is. They're completely separate from right. one another. I am Mr. Redfield. Now please let me open this door. Yeah, let's go get some chemicals. Where's uh, Rebecca then? Because wasn't she supposed to be behind you? I told her she should come with me, but I just kind of... Water seems to be sent from here. The lid is open. Use. Let's kill this stuff. Yay! Now we've Coca Cola fired the what? The fountain. No, yeah, we've apparently pissed off a plant. Yeah, we've pissed off plant 42. Well, there's no way to get all these herbs otherwise. Again. And, and that thing in the. whatever that is. Whatever it is I wanted. I want it now. What's this? It's another mansion key. It's the armor key. Another key we need. Yeah, kiwi. What's this? What's this? Now let's have a look at this key. Check the key. Flip the key. It's the armor key. So many keys. You still there? Yeah, of course I'm still here. You kind of phased out there. I've just been talking about keys. Yeah, I know. I was hearing. I was trying to like think. Of, like, I thought there was only sword keys in this because the sort of thought the sword keys replaced the armor keys, but apparently not. No, there are two types of key. There are both sword and armor keys. So the sword, armor, and helmet keys. Yes. Not going to happen, game. Stop your madness. No, that was a good dodge. Madness. Mad. What the? Oh, god, not again. Yeah. Yeah. Are we frozen? Ah, oh, great. I'm stuck on the loading screen again. The screen share has glitched out to the point where I'm stuck in a door half open. Oh, no, I'm not. Better damn well enjoy that. Fantastic uh, door. The desk is locked and then break it. No, I'm just. No, no, all I can see is Chris stunning in the middle of the room. Game, this game tends to glitch on screen chat. Oh no, look, I'm back to a door again. Which is why I probably should record it, but unfortunately my D3D gear won't work. Wait, bitch shits, where have you been? Do you want me to actually set... <laughs> do, you want... do you want me to send you my debut stuff so it'll actually help? Where the fuck did Rebecca go? <laughs> Seriously? Wouldn't it be easy uh, if I said sent you my debut or debut recorder? Probably yes. <laughs> Things would probably be much smoother. Should we try that then? Yeah, I'll uh, I'll get well one second. I'll get back to the uh, I'll go get the broken shotgun. Well, and if then, you... I'll, then we'll do this. Yeah, because we'll I need to go to I need to, well nature's calling me at the moment so. Well, right, I guess the shotgun run and then we'll stop this. All right. And if this is a part, uh, I hope to see you in part 
two or twelve or wherever the hell we are by this point. <laughs> all right. Okay. All right. Uh, I'm ending the call. <laughs>